Hey guys, in a bit I'm going to be doing some players, Oxford United's sign to stay in the championship. I'm just going to go to the cinema and then I'm going to be doing this video. Come on you yellows, win the mighty championship, come on. Yeah, welcome back again. I'm going to be talking about seven players actually I'd like Oxford to sign. Some aren't as likely as others. But ones I would like to keep us in the championship, maybe even put us to mid table. So the first one is Mark Leonard. Been really rumoured, as you know, and at Brighton with a year left in his contract, been an absolute gem at Northampton, and we've lost Bowden. And Matete was filling in that role to have another centre mid. Obviously, we want one, so we need two new ones, in my opinion. But I'm going to go for three because I think. McKechnie's not championship quality. Showed it like against Peter Barber, but he's not showed it on a daily basis. But I don't know if he's going to stay. We could get a bit of money for him. But yeah, Mark Leonard, he's a quality player. He is a quality player. As if you've seen him play this season, I think he's got two goals and two assists. So that'd be a good fit. And then obviously another one I'd like, another midfielder, Shandon Baptiste. He's a free agent. He just got released from Brentford. I don't know what they're thinking, but I think it's because of all the injuries he had. And we sold him out on for about three million to Brentford in lockdown to keep the club running because of no ticket sales and etc. So Baptiste, brilliant passing the ball, brilliant dribbler. He would be, I would generally cry happiness if he signs. So get him in, Buckingham. Listen to me. If you get these two players in, I know you want Leonard. But get Baptiste as well. And on to someone who people are saying is confirmed. Sorry for the music in the background. Selford. I think, it, I think it's Luke. Luke Selford at Cheltenham Town. Just got relegated. He's been quality. But it depends on the coming situation if he'll be first or second choice. Is he championship quality? I don't know. Coming showed in the last maybe seven to five, ten games that he is a quality player. But when he came in, he was a bit shaky because he hadn't played for nine months because he would, he got player of the year MK and then went to Chelsea and played about five games to the end of 21, so it's not a high level. So, yeah, that's really heavily linked and it depends on the coming situation if he's first choice or second choice. Even if coming to I don't know what happened. They'll be competing with each other. And Buckingham, keep Murphy and Cumming, in my opinion. Get Keep them both. And by the way, Cumming's got a market value of £1 million. I mean, he's free agent. Quality. I don't think Chelsea will get really give a flip about him, to be honest. Because he's not going to be in their team. And another midfielder. Also linked. Lula, turn the music down, please. Pause it for a sec, I'll be back. So obviously, Lula's turned it off now for the next few minutes. Luke Berry, centre mid, need depth, free agent again. 31 years old, he's a quality player. Contract's just expired. I think he's played a few games in the Premier, he's been on the bench a few times. Yeah, he's a quality midfielder again, he's got a lot of experience, what we need. Although we need to build a team, we need that experience to keep us in the division. I think we can all agree with that because we've got quite a young team. And another left back slash right back, Mikel, Me Mikel Miller from Plymouth. This would be a phenomenal signing. Not phenomenal, but he is a good player. He's been good at Plymouth. He's been very good, to be fair. Very, very good. And he can play wing back as well. So I'm writing something down. Um... Uh, yeah, he's quality. And you can bring him in as a free agent again. And it's just brilliant, all these free agents. But we're also going to have to put the wages up because we're at a higher level. And then moving on to a winger. A winger. we got Murphy. Let's hold on to him. But we need to have someone on the other side. Even though we've got Owen, we need to step it up and be very harsh. But Owen will definitely be on the bench. So yeah, he. Uh, I'm going with Mark Carnes. He is a brilliant player. A year, 
left on his contract. I doubt he'll play in the Premier League, to be honest. He's not that good. I know Ipswich have turned some League One level players, like last season, into Premier League players now. And some are on their side. Some are definitely that level. Etc. Lee F. Davies and etc. Connor Chaplin, maybe. Uh, and we need depth. And we're going to have Marcus Brown's gone, Owen Dale, Murphy, hopefully, Harness. Who else have we got? I'm probably being stupid right now, but we got a fair few more. So, yeah, we need him. I'd bring him in. It'd cost a lot of money, though. I think he's got a year left on his contract or two. But I think that's where we have to pay the money. And then one more. It's a centre-back. We're going to need competition again, even though Kieran Brown and Elliot Moore uh, combination, I don't care what you say, is absolutely divine. It is. It generally is. And then so we go, I'm going to go for Jack Watermer. I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing that right. Preston, two years left on his contract, 27. Not played enough this season for his liking, so he might be a bit unhappy. Be a good move for him, maybe, and definitely the club. He would probably want to be first team, but it depends if we play three centre-backs and win-backs. I don't know what system we'll want to play in the Championship. But that is seven players I want to bring in. Comment down below if you want any more. Because building in the window, we might lose a few players to bring in more. And another few I'd like, say Luke McNally, Kimar Ruth, George Baldock. But I see them unlucky, unlikely to happen. But thank you for watching the video, guys. Bosh, go on to the next video. Like and subscribe for more. Come on. Yeah, guys, I'm sorry. There's one more signing I forgot about. Josh Ruffles. I think with Lee, he's better at wing back. We've seen that, and he can play wing. I, I think he'd be good to play in a different system. We can play many systems because we don't want teams figuring us out. So I'd bring in Josh Ruffles. Again, returning to the club, his home. He was in the video for the final three. Uh, was it all United? He wants to come back. He's got a year left on his contract. He was playing a lot of games with Huddersfield. He just got relegated and it might have been a reason because he got injured for the last 25 games-ish. So bring him in again, Buckingham. I hope you watch this. Come on, you yellows, and Bosch again.